Hey guys, it is your boy Blast, but it was HD, and welcome to Five Nights at Freddy's Pizzeria Simulator. Now, this also game is also made by Scott Cawthon, which is now there's a there's an ultimate custom game still that we had designed some pizza. So, sausages. Uh, it looks all good. Oh, oh. I can <laughs> Round two. Oh, man. Alright. Oh, grab the other one. What the what? What's happening? Why does it all glitch? Why is it all glitched? What the? <gasps> Begin tape. Leaving dead space. Three, two, one. The purpose of this tape is to test automated response times and reactions from vintage interactive attractions following audio stimuli. If you are playing this tape, that means that not only have you been checking outside at the end of every shift, as you were instructed to do, but also that you have found something that meets the criteria of your special obligations under paragraph 4. Follow these instructions, document response times, then safely secure the space before leaving. Upon sealing the room, you are not to return. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. I got to turn down the volume because document I... results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Okay. I'm getting confused right now. Document results. Begin audio prompt in three, two, one. Ha! Ah. It's a new day. It's your time to shine. It's time to take your career into your own hands. You've saved money your whole life. Great. Now it's time to put all your eggs into one basket and take a huge gamble on your future. A gamble that comes with a 100% chance of success in some cases. What are we talking about? We're talking about becoming a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee. That's right, restaurant ownership and management. Something almost anyone can do with a limited degree of success. Sure, it's a lot of money to invest, but everyone's doing it. And that means it's safe and lucrative. With your initial investment, you'll receive everything you need to get started including a small room, some tables, and electricity. But don't forget about the money you had left over after buying your franchise package. Use it to decorate, buy a stage, buy attractions and animatronics, and much, much more. Now, let's take a look at a few things that will help you get started as a Fazbear Entertainment franchisee, such as atmosphere. Making sure your establishment has an inviting atmosphere is essential to bringing in new customers. Entertainment. 
Having a lot of entertainment value in your restaurant will ensure that customers come back. Bonus Revenue Coin-operated games and attractions can generate additional revenue during the day, which means more money in your pocket, ready for reinvestment. Health and Safety There may be times when you purchase something of questionable quality, and we don't blame you. Cutting corners is just good business. But there are steps you can take to ensure you don't get sued for it. And that brings us to liability. Being a thrifty shopper is smart, but be aware that buying things on sale comes with a certain amount of risk. Aside from the daily risk of lawsuits, there's also the risk that something might be hiding inside whatever you just purchased with that steeply discounted price tag. Of course, that would only be a serious danger if there were something outside that's been trying to get in for months now, mm. which we are not confirming to be the case. This concludes the amount of help we are legally obligated to provide. Remember, you are now the face of the newly rebranded Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Wear that smile with pride and let's make some money. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for disappearance, death, or dismemberment. Okay, so uh, I had to buy the item and drag it and put it into the, some spots. All right, here we go. Let's see how much cash you had left over after purchasing your franchise package. Great, that should be more than enough. Now let's get started. On your left are your product catalogs. You can unlock more expensive catalogs by simply purchasing items for your pizzeria. Use the arrows in the bottom right of the item window to browse the products for each catalog. When you're finished shopping, click the button labeled Blueprint Mode to place your items. You can switch back and forth between Catalog Mode and Blueprint Mode as often as you like before opening your doors to the public. When you're ready to open your restaurant for business for the day, click the button. Okay. Oh! Okay. Oh, crap. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Oh, that was really funny. But no. <laughs> oh, why am I playing this? Why am I playing this, huh? Okay. Take. Get ready. Go. Tap <laughs> Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh, why am I? Why is it falling to the death? Uh, no. <laughs> I'm getting too close to the pit ball. <sighs> Yay! Your restaurant is now officially open. Awesome! That doesn't mean your job is finished, however. You have a lot of work to do while patrons eat their pizza in the other room. From your terminal, you have supplies to buy, papers to print, and repairs to make. Once you've taken care of all... Those are Hacky Blanky! Oh! You should have known I'd find you. 
Oh! Oh! Okay. Oh, I get it now. I should have checked on Circus Baby. I should have. Alright. Hey, that was a cool tile! That looks a cool tile, my man. Look at there's the Rockstar, Bonnie, Chica, Freddy, and Foxy. With the with the parrots. Our babies. <laughs> Alright guys, well, that was really funny and scary, and thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like subscribe and start every kid as possible. Internet endorsement is so good. Until next time, see you later, YouTubers. Let's go!